hollow class. This is Jodie in India. This is Jodie in India. And today we will be today we are teaching you of the vertex, vertex form. form. So, vertex form. Vertex form. And uh, yeah. the vertex of the parabola is equal to minus vertex B. Vertex of the parabola is equal to minus B over oh. 2 A. And this can be represented. This can be represented as, as A X plus or minus K. Bracket squared plus or minus h, which is a vertex form. Which is the vertex form. So these numbers here. So those coefficients, no, sorry, co-numerals. So, yeah, represent. Represent the vertex, the vertex of, of parabola. So of a parabola. This is your parabola. So, if this, this was your parabola, would be, would be it's kh. It would be k, then so it would be the opposite of that. It would be the opposite. So, if it's a plus k, it moves okay. left. If it was a minus k, it moves to the right. No, but this is like the opposite of this. So it's, what's the word? It's like, oh my god, what's that word? Okay, let's just move on. Okay. And so, example number one. Example ten in the exercise book. Page two. Page, no, page 45. Page 45. Okay, so write the function. Write the function y equals x squared minus 6x plus 4 in the form y equals um, x minus h squared plus k. Okay, and so to do that, you complete the square. In order to do so, you complete the square. Also known as C to S. Um, and so, by completing the square, you get y equals, I hope you're doing this with us, y equals x squared. In completing the square, you get y equals x squared minus 6x plus, plus 9, all in brackets. All in brackets. Plus, plus 4, four minus, minus 9. nine. Equal, this equals y minus, minus 3 squared. Minus three. Oh, x yeah. minus 3 squared minus 5. Yeah. And then, if you want to sketch that, to sketch this, you put in your axes. You put in the axis of symmetry, and which then is x equals 3. Parabola, and this. Three. Is it counterintuitive? That was the word. Counterintuitive. Three and minus five. So that really is counterintuitive. So say the um the, the h value is the h counterintuitive. value is counterintuitive, meaning yeah, the the, so the, the three, operations are opposite to how it is sketched onto the graph. That this one is intuitive. Except k is intuitive. intuitive. This one is so, and then you get the um, this intercept. Yeah. So, is four is the x intercept. It's the y intercept. Y intercept. <laughs> and then that is how you sketch in vertex form. And that is how you sketch in vertex form. Thank you, class. Thank you, class. For listening. For listening to Enduring Day.